The Senator from Mississippi. Mr. President, I compliment the distinguished Senator from Tennessee for his remarks and appreciation and uh, extend uh, my appreciation for his strong leadership uh, in developing and bringing to the floor of the Senate the Defense Appropriations Bill for fiscal year 2016. Specifically, I urge the Senate to do as he suggests. Let's get this bill before the Senate, offer amendments if senators have suggestions for changes in the bill, and move ahead to completing action on this bill on time so we can predict with some certainty what our obligations are going to be, and we can more thoughtfully and with a sense of, of confidence know that we're doing the right thing to protect the security interests of our country and our citizens and our interests around the world. So we have before us um, an effort to move to the consideration of the Department of Defense Appropriations Bill for fiscal year 2016. The bill provides $514.1 billion in base budget funding and $58.6 billion in overseas contingency operations funding for the Department of Defense. The Senate Appropriations Committee has worked on a bipartisan basis to write and approve 12 individual appropriations bills this year. And that's for the first time since 2009. Senators should have the opportunity to debate, amend, and approve the Defense Appropriations Bill. The legislation is a bipartisan national security measure that provides the resources that are necessary to protect our nation, support our service members and their families, and meet current and future threats to our national security. We have no greater priority than protecting our national security interests here at home and abroad. So I urge senators to cooperate and support our efforts and to vote to proceed to the consideration of this bill.